Welcome to Flight Plan SMS Enhanced FRATS. This tool provides you with a customer friendly means to aid your organization in identifying flight hazards and mitigating those hazards before they lead to a risk that cannot be mitigated in the form of an incident or accident. Today, I will show you how you can maximize the potential of the new FRAT rules engine and provide flight crews with hazard mitigation strategies that are specific to your operation. Let's get started. Most FRATs require submitters to check a box if a specific hazard applies, which can lead to biases and oversights. It also does little to provide mitigation to the identified hazards. At Garmin, we are taking an innovative approach that reduces biases and oversights and allows operators the opportunity to provide mitigation suggestions for potential flight hazards. Enhanced FRATs have been built utilizing a rules engine that receives information from a customized data bank and numerous Garmin Aviation databases. Let me show you how you can create a question that can be utilized by the rules engine. First select the Settings tab and then select the Questions option to edit or add a question. To add a new question, select the Add Questions button in the upper right corner of the window. With the Add Question box open, fill in the required information. Asterisks denote fields that must contain an entry. Once you have completed your entries, select the Save button to create your question. Tags are used to help you categorize questions and rules so that they may more easily be grouped together. The Valid Before field allows you to determine the amount of time prior to the ETD the question will be available to the flight crew to answer. Some questions, such as, how many hours of sleep did you get last night, may not be appropriate to answer too far in advance. Leaving this field blank will permit the flight crew to answer the question without restrictions. To edit a question, select the pencil icon to the left of the question and make the appropriate changes. Once you have entered the changes, remember to save the question by selecting the blue Save button. As mentioned in the Questions section, Smart Frats have been built utilizing a rules engine that receives information from a customized databank and numerous Garmin Aviation databases. Here, I'll show you how you can design rules that can be utilized by the rules engine to generate a FRAT. On the Settings page, select the Rules option to edit or add a rule. To add a new rule, select the Add Rule button in the upper right corner. On the Create Rule page, fill in the required information and then select the Save button to create your new rule. Tags are used to help you categorize questions and rules so that they may more easily be grouped together. Rules can be designed to include multiple condition criteria that can be true when any or all of the parameters are true. You can also design rules that have multiple levels that will return different scores and or mitigation approaches, as you can see in the rule shown here. To display the available data sources to be utilized in the rule, select the down arrow in the Data Sources field. If an operator is required by the data field selection, a drop-down list will be available for input. Select the appropriate operator and enter the value you wish to utilize by entering it into the Match Value field. You can add additional conditions by selecting the Add Conditions box located on the right-hand side of the screen. Fill in the score and mitigation fields with the appropriate information. To add additional levels to the question, select the Plus Otherwise If button. You may add as many conditions and or otherwise ifs as needed to generate the rule. Once you have completed the rule, select the Save button to add the rule to the Rules table. The next step in setting up your customized FRAT is to create profiles and add the appropriate rules to the profiles. Profiles can be applied to both pilots and aircraft. When a FRAT is generated, the rules engine will merge the rules in the profile associated with the PIC with the rules in the profile associated with the aircraft tail number. To create a profile, first select the Settings tab and then select the Profile option to edit or add a profile. To add a new profile, select the Add Profile button in the upper right corner. On the Create Profile page, enter a name and description for your new profile. 
To add a rule to the profile, simply drag and drop the rule from the available rules listed on the right into the Rules box on the screen. Once you have finished adding your rules, click on the Save button to create the profile. To eliminate the need to repeat adding rules that may apply to several profiles, we've provided you with the ability to add an existing profile to a new profile utilizing the Bundled Profiles option. To bundle a profile, select the profile you wish to add to your new profile from the Bundled Profiles dropdown and click on the Plus button. On the Settings page, select the Settings option to go to the FRAT Settings page. FRAT settings allow you to set the low, moderate, and high-risk parameters. In addition, you can schedule when and how often your FRAT will rerun, utilizing the scheduling functionality on the FRAT settings screen. To add a profile to a user, select the User Information tab, locate the user you with to add a profile to, and select the appropriate profile from the drop-down menu. Once you have selected the profile, click on the Save button on the bottom of the screen. The profile is now attached to the user. To add a profile to an aircraft, select the Aircraft Management tab located in the Administrative section of the Setting Menu option. Then, click on the pencil icon next to the tail number of the aircraft to which you are adding the profile. Now, select the appropriate profile from the FRAT Profile drop-down and click on the Save button. To create an enhanced FRAT, select the FRAT option from the left-hand menu bar. Just as with the legacy FRAT, a flight plan generated in FlightPlan.com will populate the enhanced FRAT system. To create a flight without using FlightPlan.com, utilize the Quick Flight option by selecting that button located at the top right of the screen. Then, fill in the required information. Asterisks denote fields that must contain an entry. Once you have completed your entries, select the Save button to create your flight. Thanks for viewing our video about enhanced FRATs, and fly safe with FlightPlan.com.